Hello, everybody. Welcome to Mass Effect. Okay, seriously, welcome to Mass Effect, everybody. I don't know why I did that. I just, I just felt like a dirt in the crazy ball. Slow. But seriously, I'm going to do a bit of wrap ups here. Uh, just really shortly, I'm going in the wrong room. I kind of want to go back down and find that creepy fan guy just for kicks because he's cool and all I just I always get lost like I don't know where I'm supposed to go to find him come on guys dudes let's go but yes anyways how's everybody today Equalizing Good. interior pressure. I wasn't asking you, computer. Atmosphere. I wasn't asking you. Logged. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has Don't the care how Exo Presley is doing. I want to know how everybody who's watching me is doing. Are you all doing good? Is everybody doing hunky dory? Hey, did I scan? Ooh. I never scanned you. I think I only have like one of those to scan or something. It's pretty crazy. I'm gonna check. Hi, keepers. <gasps> I do, I only have one left to scan, oh my gosh. That's crazy. So yeah, it's uh, li uh, it's a little late on the recording. You know? Reporter Kalisa Algelani recently attempted to land Shut an up. interview with Reporter. Commander Shepard, the first human specter. Oh, no. Commander Shepard answered difficult questions, demonstrating that under that military uniform is a keen diplomatic mind. Yay. We'll have exclusive footage later today. I have a keen diplomatic mind. This is good. That's good. You guys don't have anything interesting to say to each other? Like, really? Nothing. Nothing at all. Now it's on my face. Now I get to talk. Not really, but anyway. What am I doing? I'm being a crazy, crazy, crazy person. So. We are going to go to some place in the wards. Um, uh, we'll go here. Because I'm not like 100%. I'll turn off my lamp there. I'm not 100% sure on the exact location of this guy. But. I know he's somewhere. Just outside the. Oh, he's just outside the markets, isn't he? I think. I know he's in the wards. But isn't he like just outside the markets? Like just before you go into the markets? I want to say yes. But I'm. Probably wrong. Where does this take me again? It does not say. I think I'm just going to... Let's blow our money. No, he's not here, guys. Come on. No light jogging. Doors not open fast enough. I don't want to waste my time trying to find this Conrad dude. It's the last thing I want to do. I don't want to waste my time with this nonsense. Is he in here? Hello? Where are you, sir? I know you're like a creeper. Oh, there he is. Hi. See, I knew it. I knew it. I knew he was over here. Hi, creeper, sir. Uh, Commander. I've been waiting for you to get back. Creeper? Aren't you married, you creeper? I've got an idea, and I wanted to run it by you. Um... Okay. What's on your mind? With so many human colonies being attacked, I'm not sure that one specter is enough. What if you signed me on as another specter? Uh, you gotta be shitting me. Conrad, I haven't been shot in the head nearly enough times to make that seem like a good idea. Joke if you want, but there were people who didn't believe in you, and you worked out, right? I know you're afraid to trust people after losing your team at a coups, but I'd never let you down. You're an asshat. Shut up. I hate you. <laughs> Alright, let's see. 
I'm a bad guy. Stop me from killing you. What? No, please. Please don't hurt me. Why are you doing this? Uh, yeah. This is how a gun in your face feels. It happens to me every day. You can't handle this. <laughs> That's awesome. I thought you were a hero. Heroes don't do things like this. Yeah, they do. I wish I'd never met you. Likewise, you creeper. Such a creeper. Holy crap, nine renegade points for shoving a gun in some guy's face? Serious? Oh, that's awesome. That wasn't intentional. I was just I wanted to scare him. Because he wanted to be a specter and he looked like a sissy pants. So I scared him. With my gun in his face. Because that's the only way to scare someone. Rapid transit, where you at now? Ba -na 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 -na. It's gotta be one around you yeah, somewhere. Yeah. Yen 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 yen. Yen 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 Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I have Nyan Cat in my head. I have Nyan Cat in my head. No! It's horrible. Why? Why? I don't know. A research station on Novaria has reportedly been destroyed. Not my fault. The exact cause is currently unknown. I didn't do it. Given the research conducted on Novaria, many are blaming the destruction on an experiment gone awry. Didn't do it. Administrator Analeas currently faces criminal charges as a result of the disaster, although the nature of the charges remains unclear. Yeah, it's his fault. Not my fault. He did it. But the charges remain unclear. It's because he's an asshat. That's why he got charged. He got charged for asshattery. Doors. Thank you. I hope everybody loves my throwing my gun up in his face because he was annoying me. I don't even care that I have a bajillion million. Wait, which one was it that I needed again? That one? Yeah. See, that's not even a lot of renegade points really at all. I can buy intimidate points. Awesome. Well, my shotguns and my barrier and my charm are all the way up. Why the hell not? Receive twice as many credits when selling items. Yes! Now I'm gonna be mega ultra super rich. Yeah, yeah. Caden, stop. I know what these things do. Yeah, huh? Yeah, huh? Yeah, huh? Yeah. Yeah. There we go. Good stuff. Now we're team awesome. Stand by shore party. No. Decontamination in progress. I'm gonna run by. I'm gonna get decontaminated five times. Oh, this Logged. way. The commanding officer is aboard. XO Presley stands relieved. XO XO. Which I say because hugs and kisses. Hugs and kisses, Presley. <laughs> That's his new name, hugs and kisses, Presley. Does Caden have anything to say about beds? Can we talk about beds? I like beds. Beds are fluffy. We're so close now. When we deliver everything, the Council will have to mobilize around us. If we could get the Council on our side, this could become a great opportunity for the Alliance. Yeah, that would be good, wouldn't it? It's been a struggle, but we've earned their respect now. And you've been at the forefront all the way from Akuz. I don't think anyone can stop you. I don't think I've ever met a woman like you. <laughs> I don't want to call him Lieutenant, that's dumb. You haven't had the easiest life. But I like the man it's made of you. Oh. Please, Commander, you'll make me blush. No, Bull Shepherd. I want to follow through with this. 
It's tough keeping it separated from duty. But when the mission's complete, it'll be different. I hope you feel the same, ma'am. I hear you, soldier. I'm waiting with bated breath. Oh, you are good at that. Yeah. <laughs> Shepard, you are hard to step away from. We'll get this done, Commander. The sooner the better. Yay, that was sexy. Just trying to get a sense of where the crew's at. Thoughts? I've wasted enough of your time for now, Commander. We'll have time for personal debriefings <clears throat> later. I still get a kick out of personal debriefings. Ah, it's my favorite line. What's your opinion on the last mission? Killing Saren's, uh, what was Benezzi anyway? Second in command? Advisor? Anyway, it should set him back a bit. I'm sure Dr. Tassoni's hurting, though. Poor kid. Having to kill her own mom. Thank we'll you. We'll talk later, Caden. I'd like that. Yeah, I bet you would. Debriefing! Da da da! Debriefing. We better have time for personal debriefings later, Caden. Hi. Hi, Freckles. What's up? I get the feeling you want to ask me something, Commander. Yeah. I like talking with you, Liara. No matter what the subject. Then let us talk about you. Are you okay? Huh? Why do you want to talk about me? What do you mean? You need to take care of yourself, Commander. The crew relies on you for leadership. It can be a heavy burden. I've got broad shoulders. I have no doubt about that. But can they carry the weight of an entire galaxy? If we don't stop Saren... No. Never mind. Oh. I'm sorry, Commander. The last thing you need is someone constantly reminding you of how grim things are. Is there anything else you would rather talk about? No, remind me, cute freckles. Remind me. I should go. Goodbye, Commander. You silly freckles. Liara's new name is Freckles. Everybody gets a new name. Yes, everybody. Except Caden. I mean, what am, what am I going to call Caden? Everybody gets a new nickname, and it's, you know what? If they want to blame somebody, they can blame Ashley. It's her fault. Because Ashley's calling me nicknames all the time, and I can't stand it. it makes me so mad! Brooklyn Rage! No, I'm kidding. No Brooklyn Rage. Hey, can we talk? Commander, I wanted to thank you. Oh, yeah? What for, Garrus? For everything. Taking me with you, letting me be part of your team... I've learned a lot. I've thought about what you said, about eliminating the threat immediately, regardless of the Ah, uh, yes. Cost. You were right. You were right about Dr. Salian, too. Killing him was the only solution. We had this conversation, sir. This way, we'll know he'll never hurt anyone again. I'm glad you see it that way. Keep that in mind when we meet Saren. Don't worry, Commander. I will. We're gonna, like, punch Saren in the face. Ah, drink. Okay. Hey, Rex, can we talk? Never a dull moment with you, Shepard. You ever go on any missions like ours before? Saving the galaxy from certain destruction? No. But I've had my share of adventures. Do you remember any that stick out? A few. I remember one time I was hired by a Volus diplomat. What an ass. I guess even politicians have need of mercs from time to time, huh? Time to time? If it wasn't for politicians, I'd be out of work. <laughs> They're always looking for ways to get ahead. This one was no different. He wanted me to erase his past. Get rid of an old friend who knew too much. Huh. His old friend turned out to be an Asari commando. I can see why that might give you pause. What? No. Alina and I were old friends. Sort of. We met when we were both contracted to kill the same Turian. Neither of us wanted the other one to get him first. We spent more time fighting each other than tracking that Turian. An Asari commando mercenary. That's unusual, isn't it? 
I wouldn't say it's unusual. Mercs come in all shapes. <laughs> anyway, when I told Alina about the diplomat's contract, she and I had a good laugh about it. So what'd you do? Well, I wasn't going to lose the contract, but I respected Alina. In the end, I let her pick the location where we'd fight. Huh. She chose some old Solarian space station overrun with mercs and smugglers. That way we didn't have to worry about hurting any innocent bystanders. Huh. She always was a bit of a softie. Go on. What happened on the station? What didn't happen? For two days I chased her through that station. Used my entire store of ammunition. Had to kill a bunch of mercs and use their crap weapons. By the third day, the station was barely holding together. The mercs were dead or gone. Life support was failing. But I had her. She'd locked herself in the med labs. She was trying to patch herself up. Damn tough, that one. Then just when I thought I had her, the station's core went critical. Barely made it back to my ship in time. I assume the Asari Commando didn't make it. I watched the station from a distance. I never saw her leave. And when that place blew, there was nothing left larger than a Turian's right nut. Uh... So I headed back to the diplomat to give him the good news and collect my pay. But before I got halfway there, Alina sent me a message. Better luck next time. <laughs> now, I'm not superstitious, but if someone can survive that, well, they deserve to live. At least for a bit longer. <laughs> uh, TMI on the nut thing there, uh, Rex. Seriously, <laughs> can you not talk like that around me? What about the diplomat? He wanted her dead. I told him the truth. <laughs> Alina was still alive and she was really pissed. I told him if he wanted to live, he'd need me around to protect him. And he believed you. <laughs> he kept me on as his personal guard until he died. Natural causes. Huh. Easiest job I've ever had. A little boring. But, credits are credits. So long, Rex. Shepard. That's a cool story that gave me a level up. Oh, I like level ups. Hi. Commander. Let's talk. Do you have a few minutes to talk? One on one? I should get back to my duty, Skipper. Rifles don't maintain themselves. Not yet, anyway. What's your opinion of the last mission? You mean the Rachni, right? No. They were dangerous, Skipper. I don't mean the Rachni. They Rachnai. proved that 2,000 years ago. I think it was a mistake to let them go. But that wasn't my call to make. It, it was yours. Why are you such a bitch, Ashley? If you haven't talked to Dr. Tassoni, you probably should. She just lost her mom. Yeah, just saying, I did. Skipper. I did. Dismissed, Chief. Don't call me Skipper. Ma'am. This is not the freaking Gilligan's Islands. Should probably do some selling and stuff. I know it's probably a boring episode for some people because, you know, there's no kicking ass Looking and taking supplies? names, but that's just the way it goes sometimes. Let's see what you got. You bet, Commander. I want to make sure I tie everything up before I get back into the story stuff because it's really important to me. He's got some really cool stuff. Let's see what he's got. Um, light armor. Human. It looks really good, actually. It's better than my medium armor. I'm going to buy it because even if I don't use it, I can give it to Caden. I am so Filthy, bloody rich. Mine. Um. I don't really care for this amp too much. Heavy armor for humans. I'll buy it. What about this? Holy shit on a shit sandwich. It's tasty. Um, I kind of really like the pistol there. Let's see what else this guy has. Uh, so, uh, I'll probably buy that and. Um. <coughs> I think I'll save the shotgun. But, 
we do have a lot of stuff we can sell. So just kind of get rid of some stuff I'm not using here. Assault rifle. Is that the? No, the armor I just bought should be. I don't really care about these sniper rifles. <coughs> but yeah, the armor I just bought was down here, so. Snow bl Oh, mine! Do, 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 it's in a rare rounds. So we're probably <coughs> uh, excuse me, my throat's kinda not behaving right now. Or kind of it feels <coughs> like some serious you know, shit hitting the fan kind of thing. Good seller. Snipe I like my cryo explosives. So if I keep some of those. Maybe. No, I think I like these ones better. Sell some of the old pistols. Definitely get rid of sniper rifles because I'm not using them. Uh, let's see what else here. Yeah, I, th I think we're okay now. We're also still filthy freaking rich. Oh yeah. Kinda like my <coughs> throat. Stop it. Behave. That's cool. Like the bonus to damage and stuff, but and the negative accuracy to target, but rate of fire. Well, I don't care about accuracy. I might as well put incinerary rounds on. Uh, let's see, yeah. This is some pretty spiffy armor. I look so... I don't know how to explain it. It's a really cool armor when it's on Garrus. When it's on me, I don't know how I feel about it, actually. It looks like I'm wearing like a really bad, like, wetsuit, actually. <laughs> That's what it reminds me of. It reminds me of a freaking wetsuit. Hey, Shepard. Do you need something? Um, no. If you don't really have anything else I to should say. Go. See you later. You're very cute. I'm sorry. I'll bring you with me on this mission, probably. Maybe. I can't make any promises, guys. I'm sorry. Because I usually, like, I'll say it, I'll say, I'll take you on my mission, and then my mission will come up, and I'll be like, uh, herp derp And then I won't take the people I intend to take. Which is kind of, you know, it just happens. <laughs> now I'm just humming random, random tune. Anyway, see, we can probably cut this video here and start the next one up and get get ready to go. So I will, I will be right back with the next video because I intend to friggin' All right, had to get a quick save. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys.